factitious disorder imposed on self, often referred to as Munchausen syndrome, is a rare and complex mental health condition characterized by a person's deliberate and conscious feigning or exaggeration of physical or psychological symptoms. Individuals with this disorder go to great lengths to create the appearance of illness or injury, often seeking medical attention and undergoing unnecessary tests and procedures. Unlike other conditions, the primary motivation behind Munchausen syndrome is not external gain, such as financial compensation, but rather the fulfillment of a psychological need for attention, sympathy, or the role of a patient. People with Munchausen syndrome often exhibit a remarkable ability to mimic symptoms convincingly. They may present with a wide range of fabricated medical issues, from feigned seizures and chest pain to self-inflicted wounds and fictitious infections. The fabrication is so elaborate that it can deceive healthcare professionals, leading to extensive medical investigations and interventions. The underlying psychological factors driving Munchausen syndrome are complex. Individuals with this disorder often have a deep-seated need for attention and validation in the role of a patient. It may be a way to cope with unresolved emotional issues or a response to feelings of inadequacy. The act of deceiving healthcare providers and assuming the sick role temporarily satisfies these emotional needs. Diagnosing Munchausen syndrome is challenging due to the secretive nature of the behavior and the individual's resistance to admitting to self-infliction. Mental health professionals, often psychiatrists or clinical psychologists, conduct a comprehensive assessment. The diagnosis rallies on a pattern of factitious behavior absence of external rewards, and the exclusion of other conditions that could explain the symptoms. Effective treatment of Munchausen syndrome requires a delicate and patient-centered approach, which includes 1. Psychotherapy. Individual psychotherapy, particularly cognitive behavioral therapy, can help individuals explore the emotional triggers for their behavior, develop healthier coping mechanisms, and gradually reduce the factitious behavior. 2. Building trust. Establishing a trusting therapeutic relationship is crucial. Creating an environment where the individual feels safe to share their struggles is essential. 3. Family involvement. In some cases, involving family members in therapy sessions can provide insight into the person's emotional dynamics and facilitate their recovery. Four. Medication. Medication is generally not a primary treatment for Munchausen syndrome, but may be considered if co-occurring mental health conditions, such as depression or anxiety, are present. Addressing Munchausen syndrome raises complex ethical dilemmas. Healthcare professionals must balance their duty to provide care with the need to avoid unnecessary medical interventions. Protecting the individual's well-being and addressing the underlying psychological issues while respecting their autonomy and dignity is paramount. In conclusion, factitious disorder imposed on self, or Munchausen syndrome, is a rare and perplexing mental health condition marked by the intentional fabrication of physical or psychological symptoms. Treatment involves a patient-centered, multidisciplinary approach that seeks to address the underlying emotional needs while providing support and care to the individual. Early recognition and intervention are essential to prevent unnecessary medical procedures and facilitate the individual's path to recovery.